Get out of here. Nestle doesn't make shampoo. They they make like Butterfingers or uh, chocolate. No, man, I think you'd be surprised at how much stuff has Nestle's name on it. The birds are in the nest. Execute. Over now. They make food. Nestle makes food. Nestle doesn't make anything. They just own a bunch of companies that distribute economically, you know, like uh, distributing food or shampoo. Baloney. Absolute baloney. Just listen, hear me out here. Nestle is the world's largest food company. They sell in over 60 countries and have over like 300,000 employees. Keyword, food. No, just listen to me. You know that whole thing about the branding and the different companies? Hey, did you know that they manufacture bottled water? Permission to take the shot. No, I wasn't aware that they manufactured bottled water. Ah! My cigarette. Hey, but don't you think it's odd that a company that's most recognizable for their unhealthy sweets are also putting their names on water bottles? Well, why not? If some crazy nut job of a parent comes and tries to sue Nestle for making their kid fat with all those sweet products, Nestle could refute the argument and just say they sell bottled water as well. Oh, should we, uh, expose that body, or...? Nah, I think we should just leave it there. I don't think anybody saw us anyways. Nah. Listen, I understand your point, but that seems a bit, you know, extreme for the situation at hand. And Nestle is kind of like a household item. What's, what's the first thing you think of when you hear the word Nestle? Chocolate milk. That's right. You know, Nesquik chocolate milk. You remember that stuff as a kid? You know, with like that, uh, that cracked up bunny and stuff? Sir, FUD is down. Requesting permission to go in for close quarters combat. Yeah, of course I remember that. Stuff you try to put into your milk and make it chocolate. That was the best stuff. You know, or like going to the marketplace with your folks and like seeing it at the fridge area and like begging <laughs> for them to get it for you. Yeah, but they never do because you make that stuff at home. Yeah, I know, I'm telling you, but what if I told you that that same company that made that nostalgic powder also manufactured baby food? Get out of here. Yeah. You know, what's the first company that you think of? when you talk about baby food. Gerber. Exactly. Did you know Nesquik bought it like a couple years ago for like five and a half billion dollars? Just for baby food? That's no small penny for just baby food. You see, Nestle isn't making any stupid moves. They're trying to take over everything that we recognize. So wait, you're trying to tell me that Nestle's trying to take over the world or something? Well, not really, but... Nah, nope, bull crap. All right, we're not just talking about the leading food company in, the, in all of America. We're talking about the company that runs all the food products in the world. I mean, it owns 30% of all the, the biggest cosmetic product in the entire world, L'Oreal. So that shampoo that your girlfriend has, or you know, that proactive acne stuff that your cousin is putting on, is all owned by Nestle. Now, I'm not trying to say that you know, it's trying to take over the world, but damn, it seems like it might. Damn. So how do you know about all this stuff anyway? I wouldn't expect anybody on the streets to tell me this. Because they wouldn't. I take it upon myself to know my surroundings and how the world works around me. I've got to with a job like this. You know, for instance, we get instructions to get this guy and put him off. No questions asked. I did my own research on this guy. Mm -hmm. Huh. And? Does he deserve it? Well, I mean, he's lived a pretty bad life and he hasn't always had the best of luck. Think he deserves it? No. But I don't make the rules here, do I? Oh, that was a that was a clean shot. I didn't get anything on me. <laughs> the hell? Nestle. Now we're done.